Welcome to the English news from SMS Somali TV, our top news. Somali Prime Minister Hamza Abdibari has been appointed his long-awaited cabinet on Tuesday, which included al shawabis former deputy leader Mukhtar Rawo Ali Abu Mansour as the Minister of Religious Affairs and Senator Salah Ahmed Chama as deputy prime minister. Hamza Abdi, who was appointed to the post by President Hassan Sheikh Mahmoud on 15 Sichuan, named 25 ministers, while the previous cabinet held 26 ministries. Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs and Disaster Management was scrapped, while the Ministry of the Constitution was added to the Ministry of Justice, becoming the Ministry of Justice and Constitutional Affairs. The Ministry of Environment and Climate Change has added a new ministry to the cabinet. The new cabinet, which includes members from the parliament, will have to be approved by the federal parliament before they can officially assume their roles. At least two civilians were killed in a landmine explosion targeting military vehicles near Trapon Conjunction in Mogadishu on Tuesday morning. According to an eyewitness, the explosion occurred between the intersection of Terapun and Egyptian Hospital in the Holland District, and the military vehicle survived the attack. There was no immediate claim of responsibility for the attack, but Al Shawab is usually behind such attacks. Police forces arrested several people at the scene after the blast and took them to the Holland District Police Station. Officials did not comment on the casualties of the attack. Now, moving to the southwest state of Somalia, the president of the southwest regional state of Somalia, Abdelaziz Mohamed Leftigrain, said that the security forces had captured one of the masterminds behind the suicide attack that killed the state's minister of justice in Paidaba on Friday. In an interview with the BBC Somalia on Monday, Leftigrain said he had high hopes that other al Shabaab militants responsible for the attack would be arrested or killed. The Southwest president expressed concern about the increase in frequency of explosions in his region. Al Shabaab's explosions in Southwest state were intended to divert the state's attention from intensifying security operations against the militants. He said, adding that the administration is currently working on a strategy to deal with the attacks. Southwest Regional State Minister of Justice Sheikh Hassan Ibrahim and his son were killed in a suicide bombing in Paidaba on Friday shortly after they left Yamaskri. At least 11 other people, including another son of a delayed minister, were seriously injured in the attack, according to the local officials. For more information related to our news, you can visit our social media accounts like Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and also our website by searching SMS Somali TV. For now, bye-bye. Hayat Market. Hello, salam alaikum. Waalaikum.com. Waalaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Wala sudu. Wanda wa wala al-dalab ka yigam min iso gari. Dalab ka yigam min iso gari. Aad yaad awma ha sinti yin iso diwa inshallah. Inshallah wa kusu adi yin asilu wa asilu. Aad awma ha sinti yin wala al thank you. Dariqan mariwaayi. روب أيه يقدر أي دروس تدي للابيو وحق استاد دنيني صدلبو دلبو أو كوري جاده دقيقة بيكو إيمانة طب كذا طب كذا عدريس حياة حياة وين الدقة دي وحين تصدر فافاين أنا كل حديد تلفون ده شاشة كاجا مقدا أما لسه دق أبكا أديك دوت كوم